Welcome to our channel. Today we bring you groundbreaking news in the field of hearing loss research. Picture this, a world where hearing loss could be prevented. Sounds like a dream, right? Well hold on to your seats because this might not be too far off. Researchers have made an intriguing discovery, identifying a gene called TMTC4 that plays a crucial role in triggering hearing loss. Here's how it works. Mutations in this gene set off a chain of events, initiating a process known as the unfolded protein response, or UPR for short. This process in turn leads to the death of hair cells in our inner ear, which are vital for our ability to hear. This remarkable discovery not only illuminates the molecular mechanisms behind hearing loss, but also provides a glimmer of hope for new interventions. So here's to a future where we can potentially save our hearing before it's too late. Let's dive into the key facts surrounding this discovery. First, mutations in the TMTC4 gene trigger the unfolded protein response or UPR, resulting in hair cell death and hearing loss. Second, UPR activation has been linked to hearing loss from noise exposure and certain medications. Lastly, the unraveling of these mechanisms could lead to potential drug interventions to prevent hearing loss. In a nutshell, the findings pave the way for potential drug interventions to preserve hearing. The journey to this discovery began with scientists at the University of California San Francisco UCSF. These dedicated researchers embarked on a mission to explore the connection between the TMTC4 gene and hearing loss. They set out on this scientific expedition with a blend of curiosity and determination, using a variety of research methods to uncover the truth about this mystery gene. To do this they studied animal models, examining how mutations in the TMTC4 gene affected their hearing. They also looked at inherited deafness in humans, seeking to find a common thread between these different cases. The plot thickened when they began collaborating with scientists from South Korea. Together, they were able to identify mutations in the TMTC4 gene in individuals who began experiencing hearing loss in their mid-20s. This pivotal discovery marked TMTC4 as the first gene linked to adult human deafness, a significant milestone in the field of hearing loss research. Now the question arises, can this discovery lead to preventive measures for hearing loss? The answer is a hopeful yes. Initial testing of drugs like IceRib, specifically designed to block the unfolded protein response, or UPR, has shown promising results in preventing noise-induced deafness in animal models. The researchers are optimistic that similar drugs could, in the future, be used to preserve hearing in individuals at risk. But the implications of this discovery stretch even further. The UPR, which was a significant target in this research, may have broader applications in addressing other diseases, particularly those related to nerve cells. Diseases like Alzheimer's, a debilitating condition affecting memory, thinking and behavior, and Lou Gehrig's disease, a progressive nervous system disease that affects nerve cells in the brain and spinal cord, could potentially benefit from interventions targeting the UPR pathway. In essence, the identification of the TMTC4 gene and its role in triggering hearing loss has started a new chapter in medical research. It's not just about preventing hearing loss anymore, it's about understanding and potentially intervening in other nerve cell-related diseases too. In conclusion, this groundbreaking discovery not only unravels the mysteries of hearing loss, but also opens doors to a future where deafness might be prevented. 